Welcome back everybody, it's Crazy Pop here. Today we're going to be doing some ribs on the pellet grill. We're going to slow cook some ribs because we love some ribs, don't we boys? Yeah. Yeah, who don't? You like ribs? You do? Okay. <laughs> you didn't know it at first. Uh, we got a couple racks of ribs here. Nothing fancy. We got some seasoning we like to use. It's just some regular barbecue rub. Do whatever kind of dry rub you prefer. Uh, the boys are going to help me out, get everything seasoned up, and we're going to get them put together. We'll be back in just a second and start putting some seasoning on them. Okay, the boys now are going to start putting the seasoning on. So what you want to do is just sprinkle it all over it. Don't be, don't be, don't be shy with it. Sprinkle it on there heavy, Michael. Don't be shy with it. All right, Bryson, start rubbing that in there. Just rub it all over. No, put more on there. Make sure you get everything covered. All There you go. Not in one spot, though. Want to make sure you get it all the way around. All right, so rub all that in, boys. What you want to do is make sure you get everything covered, the sides, all the ends. Make sure you get all of it done. All the little cracks and crevices, pick up any flaps or anything that may be laying around and just get it all covered. All right, we're gonna get these all seasoned up and get ready to put them on the grill. Well, we got them all seasoned up and on the grill now. We got the pellet grill set at 225, high smoke. We're gonna let this cook for about an hour or so and then we're gonna check them again. So we'll be back in just a little bit. All right, they've been on here about an hour and a half now. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna take them up and we're gonna wrap them in aluminum foil. So let's go ahead and get them off the grill and then we'll go put them in some foil. All right, we got our foil laid out. So now what we're gonna do is go ahead and take one of these racks of ribs, and lay it in the foil. And then we got some butter that we're gonna put on here. And what this is gonna do is make the ribs just fall off the bone, literally. They will just literally fall off the bone. What we're gonna do is put us butter on here, wrap it up and fold real tight and put back on the grill for several hours. And uh, then it'll be ready. So we're gonna get all this butter and get it wrapped up put them back on the grill. All right, that's what it should look like right before you wrap it up. So let's go ahead and get it wrapped up. Now you wanna make sure you seal it up pretty good because you don't want all that juice and everything coming out of it. You want it to cook. Keep all the juice in the aluminum foil. When we put them back on the grill, we'll put them back with that seam facing up. So we're gonna get the rest of them wrapped up and uh, we'll get ready to put them on the grill. All right, we got them wrapped up now, so we're gonna throw them back on the grill. We're gonna keep this smoker going about 225. We're gonna let them cook for several hours and we'll come back and check on them in a little while. Okay, we got them off the grill. Now I'm back inside. Let's unwrap them and see what we got. Oh yeah, that's looking good. Uh, see how tender it is. See if you can cut it. Or maybe we can pull it apart. Yep, see there, the bones just fall right out. That's what we're looking for. So, uh, got a beautiful color to it. Very tender and hot. So, uh, try it out next time. Next time you're cooking some ribs, try this out and see what you think. And uh, let me know what you think in the comments below. And be sure to hit that like button and don't forget to subscribe.